everybody and welcome back to Let's Mess Up Sim City with me, the Trunkleton. Right, that's the building. Hmm. I'll explain that in a minute. Welcome, <laughs> welcome back. I hope you had a good Thanksgiving. It's Black Friday now, so I hope you're not chasing down people in the malls or the shopping centers or Walmart or whatever. It's just crazy how many accidents or yeah, really bad accidents happen just because of shopping. When you can do all your deals online. Um, yeah, Origin has a huge sale right now. They up to 60% off on stuff. So I reckon if you want expansion, the expansion pack for this game or some of the other stuff, go get it from there. Be nice and cheap, ish. It's never cheap, but yeah, should be cheaper. Now this. In Cities of Tomorrow, whenever a high-density building dies, I mean not high-density, high-wealth building dies, it turns into this building right here. Strange. So that's that explained. Uh, I'm watching the traffic right now. I want to see where it is and when it is. It seems to be all workers, if I'm right. Oh no, it's students. Students, that's okay. Before it was all workers. Shoppers right now. We need to organize better. And I think this might have to become an avenue. I don't know. I, I want everything coming off the circle, but it causes a, a lot of traffic. Maybe some interchange instead. Have it come up a bit. Let's let's say bridge it over. And then have one side come off this way, one side come off this way. I don't know. I don't think, nah, it's going to take up too much room. We need to get something done about our fire station because yesterday, well not yesterday, last episode, while we were concentrating, concentrating on our nice fur ground, a few buildings burnt down, I didn't notice. Yeah, this traffic is terrible. Let's just have another quick look. I have my timer ready every time. I never press start when I say I <laughs> press record. It's okay, it's only a minute or so gone. So yeah, it's shoppers and stuff. Hmm. Ah, because these are medium wealth. That's not a problem though. Maybe we should... See, that's causing problems. The school should not be here. We need to send them up here, I think. The school. Or maybe up here. Past the high wealth, because there's not going to be much traffic here. See, there's just a few cars stopping. You turn. But then I'm thinking over here, but then I think from here is going to come through this way. I'm just trying to figure out a way to get them up to the top here. Maybe, hang on, maybe, maybe, maybe. If it's directly opposite this over here, then there's a 50% chance of them coming this way and a 50% chance of them going that way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least that's the better option. School. Um, community college. Because I'm lazy. Oh, it doesn't fit on this side. I know what we have to do. Okay, let's go in. Can, can I just bulldoze this? I can bulldoze it. Cancel. Okay, let's go inside. Uh, uh, no game. And no Trunkleton. Bad Trunkleton. So let's just bulldoze this, 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 yeah that works. And last but not least that one. Okay. Now we need this we do need this the path. Let's have it curve instead. Let's have it I am hoping that that is enough space. Just run it there. That looks awesome. And it was this thing, wasn't it? No, it wasn't that thing. Was it? Hang on, let's have a look. You got the swings. Got the carousel. Got that. So it's this. Awesome. So now let's place the community college. Ah, oh, see, look at that. Perfect. You want to place that there. So. School people from here will go up north. 
these should come up this way as well and then on this side they should go that way therefore splitting that traffic up because you are gonna die bye die bye bye yep so that's that done see look fires see because of the traffic in this area which we need to reduce and then we'll concentrate back on the fur ground so how, how, how am I going to do this? How now, brown cow? An easy solution is to have, instead of people coming up this way, because that's where they're going to school, to come down to work this way. So we could put the factories... Where is the wind blowing? I know it doesn't normally concern me. And the wind's blowing this way. So... Aha! See, everyone's working up here right now. So I have a genius plan. On the end of each of these, see this? That's enough for one One of these industrial buildings. Enough space there for that road. Perfect spacing, actually. And then, obviously, it's got to come out a bit here because of the rail line. So we'll do that. And then in this part here, the first row, we will stick the commercial. So instead of people coming along here to go everywhere, they should be coming along the side streets, down and about in each area to do this. It sounds like a better plan to me. So if we pause the game, pause. Uh, let's go and just unzone everything this is going to be crazy guys we're going to be losing a buttload of money from this the get-go what we'll do is we'll do it here first just this area right you i want you gone okay so let's bulldoze press control that was that that was that perfect you and you go you go you go <laughs> sounds okay i oh, see buildings on fire which one? That one's on fire. That one's on fire. And then these go. There you go. Um, so how are we going to do this? We want to unzone the little parts as well. Did I not unzone this? Let's unzone it. It's gone. Right, so one, two. Three, four, five. So that's five. So that means we can go. Whoa. Let's do it that big. We'll move. Well, you know what? If you guys haven't seen my um, my high density challenge, hang on. Should I have them that way? Do I have them there, then that on this road? So it's two roads for three. And then one. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. So let's um, unzone this. If you haven't seen my high density, sorry, my high population city challenge, I did quite a lot of micromanaging in that series. So if that's what we're going to do here, I think. And the ratio I used was, what was it, 20, 20 something to, was it, no, it was 13 to 7, and let's rotate, 13 to 7 to 7, so it's 13 residential to 7 commercial to 7 industry. And that worked out quite well until near the end when I decided to not go with that ratio and just started spamming residents everywhere. <laughs> but yeah. Alright, so that should work. So that this way. Okay, I'll explain it now. So the people living here are forced to come down to the edge. To come down all the way over here to shop and work. And same here. Which then means... Um, but this is, this is a different ratio than what I'm using, roughly. Yeah, probably about 12 to 6 to 6, which isn't, shouldn't be too bad, we should have excess of something. Oh, so let's, let's fill that in there. 
right so it's roughly okay so yeah the traffic should be on these streets instead of on, on the avenue so if we do that we keep that as is I know I said I wanted to change this whole area but if we're gonna do this and we keep the traffic free we might not need to change the area we got a different area here and it's different here so a bit of blockiness might not matter too much and then we'll have to change we we'll definitely have to change this area up we're gonna have to move the city hall okay so let's fast forward time so in other news in my sim cities of tomorrow series i've gone a new direction we're building two cities at once that's right dos suidades per uno episode i don't know what episode is in spanish i can't remember oh i'm pressing the wrong button bulldoze so many screenshots then unnecessary so we'll get this sorted and once we got people moved in we'll demolish this area come on burn down already there we go the weird thing is is right if we look at a fire stats two buildings burnt down per day but that one those two there weren't classes burnt down because they didn't hit the ground if they turn to rubble it's classes burnt down if not it's just classes okay it's a crazy game See, look at that instantly high density that's what i love about this game so they will only go to medium density hopefully there's enough room well there is enough room they're very picky so it should sort out it should alleviate the traffic here so basically people are going to work this way and this way they're going to school so traffic should run the other ways we, we have a garbage problem is the garbage where is the garbage oh, are you full now you get in there we need another incinerator which is okay I don't think on a normal city I'm not talking the high density uh, not yeah high density high population city uh, you know just the normal cities that I do I'd never run out of I never had to add I don't think an extra garbage dump once that incinerator starts working, that's going to drop. Oh, see, look, it's dropping. Brilliant. You just add four of these things. The thing is, it, they only go out sideways, and it's it's annoying. You see how much extra room that's taken up? So why can't we fill it in at the back here? You see that? We should be able to put it right there. Let's check. I bet we can only see. You can't put it. It should, be able, it should fit there. See, it only pops on the snap point. Only here, here, it's so ridiculous. It has to be connected to the main building, which is weird. Don't like that. One of, so there's a quite a few buildings here that are waste waste space like this. Adding at the back. See this is about the equivalent of a back to back building. Maybe. Or close to it. When you add the the Department of Finance to the back, it starts to mess it up. It goes a bit too big. So, or there's like the these actually can if you keep them as six, it's not too bad because you can fill up the space. But when you get that seventh one, that's wasting space. The same with this. Uh, yeah, that's my little rant of waste space, <laughs> waste of spaceness. So these are gone high density. We should see a change. See, people are just walking now. Don't know where they're walking to. Maybe to this shop here, which is good because these take up 600 jobs and provide 400 goods. See, look at this bomb building fire. Didn't burn down though. Don't like it. Oh, we're making 3,000 an hour now. So let's get this area sorted. Let's unzone. See, what we'll do here is we'll, we need to add, I think we need to add one extra industry building somewhere, or maybe two, to supply the, the freight for the medium and the high wealth. Let's just get rid of all this crap. Okay, so this road can actually come out a, a bit farther. Yeah, all the way 
with uh, solving this actually. Let's bulldoze the end piece and do this properly. Come on, game. There we go. Okay, it's gonna fall down there. So let's do that. And right here. So that means we need another connection. So if you're high density, so we need to come across to about here. That works perfectly. I think. Uh, maybe because this is not long enough. Uh, let's come over a little bit far farther. See if I see again. I keep doing that now. I'm not really looking at my keyboard. Crazy, crazy guy today. Okay, I don't know if that's straight, but it'll do. So we want more industry here and here. Hopefully that works. And then you there, you there. In fact, one more for you. So I'm feeling nice and kind. Put that there and that there. So now we need to pause the game again. Just so I can do this. Unzone that. Please do not be on fire. Bulldoze you and you. Not you guys, you're new. So let's... Uh, I have a sweat rash on my wrist. Because of my mouse pad. My mouse mat, whatever it's called nowadays. My, I should have bought the metal one, the aluminium one. Or aluminium, sorry Americans. Yeah. But yeah, it's giving me this horrible sweat rash on my wrist. And now I moved it, and my hand is on the marble. Marble desk, yep. Fancy. Did I? Yeah, let's put that there. So that's super sweaty now as well. I got a feeling it's just still gonna get worse. I have to figure this out. It's annoying. It's a bit stingy. Yeah, my wrist is a bit stingy today. I've been playing a lot on my PC recently. I've been prepping for Minecraft building SimCity, and that should be up later today as well. Ah, uh, the traffic is here. In here. Let's see what's going on. Workers. Workers, workers, workers. I can understand why. You need to grow. These two and these two. That's 6, 1200. 1200. About 1500 jobs here. And you are. If we do this right, 4, 8, 1200 there. So this row alone will only work here pretty much. Which means these are going to find work. That's why we got block of workers here. And it's the same for these two rows. You see, these three will work in these buildings. And then they've got to find work. So, we need a solution for that. And if we check out the details. Yeah, we need extra shops. So this is what we're going to do. We can narrow this down. Let's bulldoze. Let's see now. This is why I did it this way. Pause the game. Let's unzone this and bulldoze it. And we can bulldoze those two and unzone that. So that area. We have to bulldoze this building and get it smaller. And then we can put residents there. So we'll have two. And two commercial buildings. And that should be enough to get this then. I think. And if we bulldoze this. We'll get three buildings here. Maybe. Ah uh, no we won't. So if I click that. Ah uh, we don't have enough room. Ah. Uh, man. We don't have enough room for three. On this row. Because the space taken up here, I don't think it's the same as here. Maybe it is though. Maybe it just looks a bit off to me. Maybe we'll get free in. So let's bulldoze these free. And let's escape. Not escape. Speed it up. Let's bulldoze this one. We need to get two built here. Should be enough space to do that. See, one there. Uh, that's perfect. And there's more than enough room there. 
that's perfect see this is the micro management I was talking about so you've got two right here so we're gonna need freight that should build up into one big one see the same size there they're all different sizes they can stay quite narrow which is good and that means we've got to do the same here so I'm gonna we've got to do the same on every row yeah figuring this out and that's what I wanted to do <laughs> sorry guys so let's unzone that rezone that and you see we've got just a tiny bit of space there to unzone this and re no not rezone it it's bulldoze the, the row we've got to get just enough space in let's bulldoze this and this so what we'll do now is that might be enough for two buildings but we'll add the one there we'll put that there and we will we've got the problem now of it might not work because <laughs> they build to the right you see instantly into the, the corner so there's going to be a small gap at the end here ah yeah doesn't work but if I now unzone that is that enough I don't think it's enough let's bulldoze you see that's built it's still left a gap ah are you kidding me kidding me game there that would do actually it's half the size of what the other one was it's pretty much the same though so let's bulldoze it all until we get the right amount in you need to come over a big guy <sighs> yeah that should be enough I don't think we're gonna get the three buildings in that's weird, I right clicked and that changed. So we need to do the same here. But we're lucky here. Because we can just un We can just unzone this, bulldoze this. And then let's go one, two No. Bad game. That. We can add the blue in there. And the blue in there. All those these. And once the blue have grown in here, once the commercials grown in here, we can squeeze in the the factory again. So he's doing that. But if you look, people are walking. It's well, it's late now, late at night. I have to take a sip of. Oh, the maid took my water. I was about to drink that crazy girl. Now I've got nothing to drink. It's ridiculous sometimes. That's too big. So bulldoze that. Maybe another narrow one. So we can. I can I unzone? That's too big. There, let's unzone that. And let's can I rezone it? Let's do that. And hopefully. If I now no crazy game build we'll let that fix itself oh no 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 don't pull those we got rubble anger so yeah let's pull those where's our rubble why aren't we getting that don't know what whoa did you see that that was vacant let's go to the rubble there pull those okay hopefully they go medium density what happened here so that's another rubble. Come on. Ah, you crazy game. But if we look at this, that's more than enough room. The industry keeps doing this as well when I was doing my, my other city. It has enough space to to grow and it refuses. Let's do that then. See, look, it's got more than it's got the right amount of space, but it refuses to grow. And it says we did they need it? It's crazy, crazy, crazy. I just where's my power plant? I said we needed power a minute ago. We got more than enough. What's going on? Global deliveries. We need more. Hope it's coming. Whoa, factory. What's going on? Still traffic here. 
So now we've got... What's going on? Why are you not growing? Hmm. Let's see. We've still got unemployment and we've still got unsatisfied shoppers. So a shop should grow to fill both of those in. But it says we have no commercial demand. That is makes no sensibles at all. How can we have no commercial demand when we need jobs and we need to satisfy shoppers? There should be a huge commercial demand. Broken. That is so broken. Um, once these two are built, let's see, that'll fill out the jobs and the unsatisfied shoppers. And it should help ease the traffic a bit, I guess. I'm hoping. <laughs> it's, that one's built now, so are you hiring? Our business needs more stuff. See, unemployment now has gone to zero, unsatisfied shoppers has gone down to... 197. So once this one's finished, we should see no unsatisfied shoppers, but then people will still complain. So what is the traffic now? Workers, still workers. See, that's finished building now. They should all go in now. So shoppers are all walking, apart from in this area here. There's a lot of people walking. So that works. I just noticed something strange, but I'll fix that out in a minute. That's... It probably needs a couple of in-game days to sort out, but maybe the shop is from this area. We've still got to fix this area up. And see, see, look, it's built on the other side of the road. Why? Oh, it's double zoned. <laughs> Everything is double zoned. Which side do I want it on then? Well, uh, we will go as. <laughs> crazy, crazy guy. Let's bulldoze him then. And get him down there. So, we want more residents. Same again. Uh, ooh, it says, 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 puede. It says it can do it. Yeah, it can. So now let's do, well, okay, let's bulldoze you. I'll do it. I'll do it. We'll fix this all up in a minute, guys. I do apologize. Because that is going to lower the median wealth land value here. But then we can fix that, can't we? So, bulldoze that. See, tree roll can go right in there. So, let's have a look at this. Yeah, it's another pause job. So, let's, let's just unzone everything again. And we want to bulldoze it all and get the land value medium. Actually, that's probably fine. No, yeah, let's zone that. That's fine. Okay, but let's bulldoze everything else. And you. So. One zone. One zone, one zone. So what we want is these take up one, two, three. I think that's maybe enough for a high density building. I'm guessing. Ish. Maybe that needs an extra one. And then we will go like that. Like that. Game. Come on. To the. Uh, ta -da. So we're gonna fix this up, but for now this is what we want. So speed that up, let it grow. Oh, and we need to put in parks, don't we? Nature. So let's see. We need. Boom. That worked. Need one more. One. One, one more. I think right there will do. 
yeah right opposite each other let's check out the land volume map perfect awesome so that works so we've got medium wealth here medium wealth here now these should come up here and then go down there but I'm just, just thinking a second guess in fact I'm not going to think we'll leave it to next time with a building on fire, burn out very quickly. We're still trying to sort out the traffic. Hopefully this settles down. It's a good good few ga in game days. So I want to thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like. If you want to watch some more, subscribe. If you have any comments and we need a name for this city, please leave it in the comment box. And thank you for watching again, guys. Bye bye.